How to fix connection issue in HMA Pro VPN for iPhone slash iPad. Server selection, for first time users, you must first install a VPN profile, note, once you have logged in for the first time, there is no need to log in again. 1. The app will request to install a VPN profile, just click on install profile and allow, what you need to do next is confirm it with your iPhone password and allow notifications, in case there is a drop in connection, you know immediately now you're able to select change modes and select a server. By default the app selects a VPN server nearest to your physical location to provide the best possible connection quality in terms of speed and stability. To switch to one of servers around the world, just tap on all and find the server you'd like to connect to, the country selection view will open, displaying all countries with VPN servers available. Tap the country to automatically select the best server from there for establishing a VPN connection. You can select the servers by either browsing through the country and server list, or use the search function. Now enter a term, e.g. the name of a city, state, or country, and you see all related servers displayed. Next, establish a VPN connection by tapping on slash off button. While the VPN connection is active, you can see the status in the notification area of your device. It displays the download and upload speed and total bandwidth. Downloaded and uploaded during this VPN session. To bring up the HMA iOS app back up to the foreground quickly, tap the notification that displays the bandwidth, top notification. To open the VPN connection management window, tap on the second notification, VPN is activated by HMA VPN. You can also check your connection rules, custom settings that let you control how and when you connect to VPN connection issues, if the app won't connect to the VPN, there are a few basic steps you should try to identify and fix the problem, try VPN servers from a different area slash country. Try connecting using a different connection, 3G slash 4G Wi-Fi. If using Wi-Fi connection, log into your router's web configuration, temporarily disable the integrated firewall. Try connecting from a different Wi-Fi network, e.g. at work or at a friend's house, to see if the issue is restricted to your own Wi-Fi network. If using 3G slash 4G connection, try connecting from a Wi-Fi network. If this works instantly, your cell provider might be blocking VPN-related ports and you need to try alternative connection methods and VPN protocols.